This is a Pony Prepper Bill. Today is uh, June 20th. And uh, yesterday I had a bunch of helicopters, the fire units or whatever flying over our house. Didn't know what was going on, and then somebody said that Wharton State Forest was on fire that butts right up against us. So I didn't really see anything. It's nice and sunny at our house, but it was 600 acres, and it went to like 2,100 acres. And then I just looked it up like an hour ago, and they said it's so much contained yesterday, but now it's like over 7,000 acres. I don't know if you can see me. It's bright as hell out, but you can't really see it with the smoke. Well, it's sunny here. But we got a forest fire. It's blowing away from my house for now. No rain in for the next two days. It was supposed to rain today and then tomorrow, and the wind's picking up. I don't know if you can hear me, but the wind has shifted, and now it's blowing towards us, towards my house. And I didn't really see anything until I went around a corner of my house away from the trees because it's blowing away from us but the wind looks like it's shifting now and it could be blowing towards our house I'm only uh, four miles from my house now and that's probably about 15 20 miles from us uh, one of the videos I made was at Batstow uh, like one or two video two or three videos ago walking around Batstow village it's all around there right now I don't know how many miles that is by the way the crow flies, but it's like 25 minutes drive. And it ain't looking real good. Let me drive around and see. I heard a couple roads are closed. Authorities have shut down sections of routes 206 and 542. State officials say it could grow to 15,000 acres and is on track to become the largest wildfire in New Jersey in 15 years. Well, I don't know if you can see it. This is dark. I am about 10 miles from my house. The road's closed. It's dark. It's orange. If you can see my shirt, there's ash coming all over me. Fire trucks are everywhere. I'm getting covered in ash. The fire is bigger than I thought it was. It is not only it, it smells like it's burning like right here. It's hard to breathe. Batstow's that way, I live that way, and the fire is shifting a little bit. The wind, I don't feel any wind here, but over by my house, it was blowing like crazy. But there's ash everywhere. Here we go again. Check. Well, here I am at Atson. All the news crews are here. Fighting fire with fire, that is the plan, that is the strategy here in South Jersey as dozens of firefighters use all types of apparatus trying to bring this wildfire under control. An eerie vision from the ground and just as frightening to view from the sky, a wildfire in Wharton State Park in South Jersey has charred thousands of acres and forced evacuations from campgrounds. Officials say the wildfire lived up to its namesake, moving east and then back west across the Mullica River, fueled by high winds and dry brush. Given the conditions, given the fire behavior, and so what our strategy became was to regroup, to back out to a safer area, and then let's try to consume all this vegetation that's gonna feed this fire in the future to essentially fight fire with fire. 
Crews set controlled lines around the moving fires, trying to contain the spread of what may be the largest wildfire in more than a dozen years in New Jersey. Officials ruled out any natural cause to this wildfire. Fires over there, the roads closed. Uh, looks like shit that way. This way it's not too bad. Nice and sunny. The wind dropped a little bit, so that's a good thing. And hopefully we get some rain in the next day or two. There's a fire there, a fire over there, a fire down there. They closed a lot of the parks. They closed the camping, all the canoeing and kayaking. And when I was driving around, it was funny. I saw one of the canoe places was packed. There's people, cars there, and I thought they were looking at the smoke for the fire. Now, I saw a couple of buses pulling the canoes. People were canoeing and kayaking in Wharton State Forest where they supposedly closed it and you can see the parking lot people getting on the buses to go canoeing heading towards the smoke now there when you go canoe you go downstream and that's where the fire is so when you're canoeing wherever they drop you off you're going towards the fire where there's smoke there's fire I, I don't understand these people but anyway, people were canoeing and kayaking towards the fire. Intelligent people. I guess they're too busy on their phone to look up and see that there's a frickin' forest fire. I'm back at the command center. Uh, the fire trucks are doing their stuff. The helicopters are flying around doing their stuff. And I'm gonna head home and get stuff ready just in case we need to evacuate. I doubt it, but you never know. This is what I got. This is Piney Prepper Bell. I'll talk to you later.